all right my people welcome back on to this one thanks so much for subscribing to this channel well my people still on ujudua nation hmm? the people are still on it ujudua nation now ujudua nation now now that's what the people are still talking about well on to this one the matter of professor banji akintoye hmm? on to this it has been confirmed and then it has been said that professor banji akintoye wants a fake yoruba nation agitators set up by the federal government hmm, this one is another serious one so meaning there has some setup of yoruba nation agitators they will be agitating for oh yoruba nation oh sunday Bowo, we love sunday Bowo. that there are some setup that are you no know, pretending to be the yoruba nation agitators Tators coming from the federal government. This is another serious one. I think this is something that everybody needs to be aware of. All right, onto this. Mm, the leader of the umbrella body of Yoruba Self Determination Groups, Ilano Homo Odua Hi O O, Professor Banji Akintoye, has raised an alarm that the Nigerian government has recruited some political jobbers, come reactionaries masquerading as yoruba nation agitators to blackmail him in order to sabotage the yoruba nation struggle into a paralysis hand hmm. well onto this the ado born renowned historian said credible intelligence available before him shows that these political contractors have been paid in dollars and naira to wage war against him and then some of his trusted aides for refusing to compromise against the teeming Yoruba people. Well, unto this is said, a world press conference being sponsored by the Nigerian government has been put together by these saboteurs for 2 p.m. today on November. Yes, talking about November 18, 2021, to blackmail him in order to silence him. All right, and then I can tell you, however, said all the evil plans of these low cost against him and the yoruba people shall fail stating that they are only destroying and then building a bad history for themselves he said those who told they are packed in the past are now forgotten and then only remembered as judas iscariot by the yoruba people well in a statement he personally signed and then made available to newsmen by the communications secretary of IOO, Mr. Maxwell Adelaye. Professor Akintoye said he tolerated these reactionaries for too long, but they are never satisfied with everything he did to place them, stating that all they are after in the struggle is self recognition. These reactionaries celebrated the invasion of one of my lieutenant Sunday at the Yemo Igbo's house by the Nigerian government. They never wanted the young man come out of the prison where the Nigerian government is currently holding him in the Republic of Benin. The offense of Sunday at the Yemo is that he has become the face of the struggle, even more prominent than myself. They would grumble that they have been in the struggle for years and then someone who just joined the struggle is now a celebrated hero. I appealed to them to see this as a sacrifice and then a battle for our children, but they refused to listen. Well, the last straw that broke their camel's back was when they refused to release the organization's fund in their possessions to be used to add to the funds we wanted to use to pay Igboho's lawyers in Republic of Benin. Well, we were held into ransom. I had to impose some disciplinary measures in the overall interest of our people which got them angry and even since these reactionaries have been threatening to scatter the struggle they have started blackmailing me and then one of my trusted aides 
for refusing to compromise when their faceless campaign of calumny failed to materialize they are now coming out openly to blackmail me in order to please their paymasters in Abuja and lagos a press conference is to hold by 2 p.m to blackmail me they are being sponsored by the fulani controlled nigerian government in jj media and then other new media platforms have been recruited to live stream it they have invited some nigerian journalists we now we now they are we know they are sponsors okay but i am sure the yoruba people will fight this low cost we won't be intimidated soon they will know they are a tiny minority the whole agenda is to demoralize me so that the fulani controlled nigerian government can jubilate while they smile to the bank but my mind is made up to fight to the end of my life my appeal to the yoruba people especially the younger generation is to come out now and take over the struggle from this locust we must never return to the egypt hmm. this is mainly your battle not mine i am challenging the yoruba people below the age of 50 to take their destinies into their hands take over now all right my people and this one had been from professor banji akintoye himself yes right now we now know what is going on in the country right now we have seen that there are so many set of you no know, people who call themselves the yoruba nation agitators but this time around we have seen that they are you no know, betrayers they are the set of people that actually came in because of the monetary aspect and then this time around it has shown to the whole world that this set of people do not have the interest of the Ojujua nation at hand. Well, thank God for the life of Professor Banji Akintoye and he has seen it that, oh, what else is he looking for in this life that he has not gotten even at his own age? Definitely he has told all these people that, hmm, see this struggle is not our struggle but it's for the generation unborn but they refused to listen and uh, this time around they are now looking for every means to you know tackle professor banji akinto you no wonder you no know, some days ago we had we had some of them have been like oh professor akinto you must leave the organization must be sacked hmm. not knowing that hey, they want to embezzle money because they have accused professor banji akintoye of embezzling money and uh, this time around we have now seen that the reverse is just the case and then right now i don't know what are these set of people what are they looking for what do they tend to gain from all this because of you no know, things that will not last right now professor akintoye has you no know, repeatedly tell it to them that no this struggle should not be for you but for the children unborn but they refuse to listen hmm, this is so serious and this is to tell you that there are so many people out there that are pretending to be a Odua nation agitator of which they are fake hmm, this is serious and this time around professor banji akintoye is now announcing it out that the federal government <laughs> as it starts right now had been paying some set of people some money dollars in naira hmm, to you no know, pretend as one of yoruba nation agitators this set of people will come out to say oh ah uh, sunday Igbowo is our man not knowing that they are informants they are there everybody needs to be careful be watchful hmm, this is so serious my people hmm. well a lot of people have actually reacted on to this hmm, there are so many people on to this one that are fake hmm, that's exactly what we are talking about all right my people and then that has been it on this one what more can we say meanwhile let me have your take on this my people and remember to subscribe for more updates if you are new on this channel all right thanks and god bless Thank <laughs> you.